Hello everyone, I'm Norman Prime, and today my last review will be Star Wars 30th Anniversary Collection Toys R Us exclusive. Hold on a side. Toys R Us exclusive Stap Attack 30th Anniversary Collection. This is from Attack of the Clones. Let's take a look. As you can see here, these are steps, aka single trooper aerial platform vehicles. You can see them in the Clone Wars and Battle Droids riding. This pack came with two of them, so I'll only show you one. Of course, they're both the same. And it also came with a Super Battle Droid. So, first I'll show you the Battle Droid. It's a lot shinier than most other Battle Droids. Arms, arms, rotate, elbows, ro elbows bend forward and back. The waist rotates and bends, knees, knees go forward and back, and legs go forward and back. It is a lot shinier than most Super Battle Droids, which is actually kind of cool. It's easier to notice it. So there he is. I'll just stand him up right there. Oh, and the elbows rotate 360 degrees. Here is one of the steps. I have it in a display stand, so you can just take it out of there, like so, if you want to just ride it around. It comes with a battle droid, which is removable, so I'll just put that down for now and give you a look at the battle droid. It's like a standard battle droid. Blue shoulders and a blue abdominal, abdominal, dominant, blah blah blah. Don't know my body parts. <laughs> Head is on a ball joint. Shoulders rotate 360 degrees. Elbows bend forward and back um, very widely which is kind of cool. Uh, legs go forward and back, knees bend forward and back. These are actually pretty cool. I, I prefer them more than the normal battle droids. I, I like the blue shoulders and the blue lower chest. To put them back on the step, there are two little pegs for his feet. So, you, so that's how you begin, and then you bend his knees a little bit so that he could reach the handlebars, and then slip in his fingers, side and side. So there you go. It's now on a step. Now I will show you the action feature of this. So. I'm going to use the, and to put it back on the stand, all you have to do is just line it up like this. And it just slips in. I like it more on the stand, because I display them, so that's kind of cool just to have it out there. So, I'll use this one for the, for some reason, I'll just use this for the action feature. Now, what this does is it fires two missiles right here at the same time. There is a little button at the bottom of the stand, as you can see, and if I press that, they fire. Oh.
And also, these go up. Now, this isn't part of the review, but as you can see, I have the Star Wars Legacy Collection Millennium Falcon. It's amazing. So, I don't know if I will be getting to review it. It's like incredible. I highly recommend it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to review it, but that's just my short little review right there. It's amazing. I highly recommend it. Even though it's $160, I highly recommend it. <laughs> Thanks for watching.